We just finished part number six, integrative bargaining. We looked at some vocabulary and phrases, and then we looked at the introduction. And what did we learn? That integrative assumes differences can be understood. Differences can be overcome. Both sides can get what they want. This is also called win-win. Both sides understand the needs rather than the demands. Integrative bargaining is not about compromising. It's not about going halfway. Rather, integrative bargaining is about finding a solution that gives both sides what they need in full. Next, we looked at a dialogue between Jane and Fred where they used integrative tactics in a personal negotiation over food. And remember the result? Both sides were happy. Both sides got what they want. We also looked at Alex and Fred using integrative tactics in a business negotiation. What was that about? That was about a new job. Getting a new job, taking a new job, accepting a job. And what did we find out? That even though there was a problem, a disagreement about pay, they ended up that Fred and Alex could find a solution where Fred was happy and Alex was happy. Why? Because the pay was lower, but the education benefits were higher. It ended up making everyone happy. Not half happy. 100% happy, 100% happy, everybody was happy. Okay, you can see Tux and I, we always use integrative tactics because we're win-win. Right, Tux? Win-win. Yeah? Keep on working hard.